What a life, what a day. <laughs> you know, it's funny. Third day in a row, my account's gotten used or authorized for a payment I didn't authorize. It's all good, still thankful. As soon as I stepped onto the beach, saw a dime. It was for me, directly aligned on my path, foreshadowing my support and abundance and my prosperity, you know. The first thing upon getting to your destination, you arrive and receive. Well, that's a good sign to me. <laughs> Was working a lot with the wind energies. For some reason, on the beach, it is extremely windy right now. <clears throat> I was able to learn how to manipulate the angular rotational spin of the area around me to create vortices, essentially to funnel the wind energy which is going to represent the mental body or the thought body and you know i just realized last night with opal that i'm low-key um a physiology or a physiologist and um you know all i do is kind of study nature and the natural order order of systems and i came to realize something by just observing the wind when it comes to our thoughts we can either be blown away by them or we can be pushed by them or you know in reality you can be neutral or transparent and allow them to simply or merely flow through you to pass through you just like our thoughts need to not be attached to we must allow them to flow. And while simultaneously doing this, working with that ocean or that water or the emotional body. You know, these past couple of days have been pretty heavy. Really heavy, in fact. You know, um, everyone is almost feeling the effects of this, uh, this gateway that just opened. You know, I haven't even really read too much into it. I've just been feeling it. <laughs> you know, and... Um, there's been a lot of shit kind of getting just kicked to the surface. And it's important that we deal with it now, as opposed to it just getting re-imprinted right into our manifestation transduction sequence and have to walk that karma or experience that unwanted circumstance once again. But you know, I'm beginning to realize why the beach itself allows me uh, to flow so freely and to obtain so much creativity it is the raw forces of the elements that are here that we are able to harness or utilize and alchemically create other morphogenetic fields or matter or circumstances external projections there's something very special about being by a body of water it also represents feminine energy as feminine energy is essentially the substance of creation and masculine the guiding force behind that creation wow is it ever so windy today at the beach this guy's taking up the meditation tarp I was sitting on bastard <laughs> What a day it has been already. And I'm so thankful for the abundance and prosperity that I've already been led to. You know, all we can do is exist now and move forward. Where are you guys today? Are you continuing to dwell on the past over something that you now no longer have any control over? Or are we allowing ourselves the space to move forward and go on about our life and not continue 
to project that same unwanted circumstance that's making us feel that way in the first place. At the end of the day, you have a choice as a free willed, multi dimensional, sovereign being of light. And so it is. Reclaim your power, reclaim your divinity. And I think that's the end of this transmission. I love you all so, so much. I know it's early in the morning, but early worm, early bird gets the worm, right? Love you all. Peace.